we have two android devices here on one device we have the customer app on this device we have the driver app so let us try making a booking to make a booking we will enter the pickup location we will enter the drop location then we will select a cab category and then we will click right now so let's start with entering the pickup location now you can see it is taking um, my current location as the default pickup location so i would prefer to keep it as it is let's keep the pickup location as it is let's enter the drop location now so i will enter a drop location let me enter a nearest metro station huda metro station okay so i have entered the drop location well pickup location is my current location it has taken me to the uh, de uh, destination location <clears throat> if i click on the pickup location it will take me to the pickup location so now i have to select a cab category i have various categories here i can select hatchback i can select mini luxury i can select then suv so it will show drivers according to the cab category selected now here we have driver for hatchback category and if we want to send the booking to this particular driver so i will select the same category the hatchback category okay so we have selected pickup location we have selected drop location we have selected the hatchback category now let's click on right now okay so it has created an animated route from my pickup location and the drop location here i can see the estimated time arrival and i can see the estimated bill amount i will also select a payment type i want to pay by cash i want to pay by paypal or credit card and other payment gateway can also be integrated based on the country uh, availability of the payment gateway so but for demo let us use cash only let us do use cash i can also apply coupon if i have any coupon i can apply it it will discount the ride uh, accordingly let's confirm so i'll confirm the booking okay so now we can see the booking has been sent to the nearest driver driver has an option to cancel it driver has an option to accept it if i cancel the booking it will go to the next nearest driver so let us accept it here so the booking has been accepted by the driver and customer has got the notification that your booking has been confirmed customer will click on okay yes now customer can see driver location and customer can see his location customer can track the driver to his pickup point in the real ride you will be able to see uh, the driver tracking properly to your pickup location so this is because we have Uh, both customer and the driver on the same location so these are overlaying but in the real ride you will see a complete route created and you will be able to see uh, the driver moving in the real time customer can call the driver customer can see the driver details in this particular section customer can also cancel the ride and on the driver app first of all we have a black background of the map in the driver app because um, with a black background driver will not face any problem Um, in heavy sunlight during the day he will be able to see the map properly in 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 heavy sunlight as well so here we have some options uh, uh, we have we have a navigate button which driver can use to navigate to the uh, to to navigate to the customer location and uh, we we have this particular section which shows the customer pickup location and once he reach the customer pickup location he will click located which means the driver has arrived so let us arrive i'll click on the located from the driver app okay so the driver clicked on located and customer has been notified that your driver has reached at the doorstep customer will click on okay so it has created a route between the pickup and drop location and uh, uh, now the customer can see an animated route over here and on the driver you can see here is a meter so when the driver will move after begin trip this meter will keep updating as he moves whatever the kilometer or miles he travel it will show over here it will it will update in the real time so let's say both customer and driver are on the same uh, are on the uh, are in the same cab 
then driver will begin trip here is a begin trip button he can still cancel the booking let's say if customer refused he can cancel the booking so let us begin trip to complete the ride now driver has begun the trip customer has been notified that your ride has been started now the ride has been started now when driver will move both of them both customer and driver will be able to track themselves on this route the map will automatically zoom according to their movement and the marker will move on this map so in an actual ride they will be able to see the complete tracking and this meter value will keep updating in the driver app which will calculate how much distance you have traveled again driver has an option to navigate to the destination location as well now once they are reached on the destination driver will end the trip so let us end the trip okay now driver has ended the trip and accordingly a bill has been generated on both customer and the driver app so customer will see the bill customer will see the breakup of the bill and here is a button to make the payment customer will make the payment so the payment is done because we selected cash as the option otherwise it would have opened a payment gateway or a credit card enter screen or it would have automatically deducted payment from the credit card we have all such options for making the payment so after making the payment now there is an invoice on the customer screen it's a final invoice <coughs> with brief summary with the invoice number date and all he can also rate his ride customer will rate the ride and click done so the customer is done with his part and driver has also an option to rate the ride so driver will rate the ride as well so the ride is completed successfully now